Welcome back to Gothic Homemaking. It's showtime! I'm Aurelio Voltaire, and I'm often called the Martha Stewart of the Coffin Crowd. That's because I'm very we love this. I love this. Halloween next week, and for those who have not decorated your homes, you can always learn a thing or two from our next guest. The New York Times dubbed him the Martha Stewart of Macabre homemakers. I'm so fascinated by this. Aurelia Voltaire is an expert in all things eerie and also has a brand new book, Gothic Life, the essential guide to macabre style. Aurelio Voltaire joins us now. Thanks so much for being here. Happy Halloween, Happy Bianca. Halloween. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. This is my favorite holiday of the year. Mine. So this is my favorite kind of decor you brought with us. So if people are thinking about maybe throwing a last minute Halloween party. Absolutely. What are your top tips for making something spooky and elegant? Well, these are some of the simpler projects yeah. in the Gothic Life book. And this is the very simplest project I've ever done on Gothic Homemaking. <laughs> so I always like to start with this one. It's the Gothic Bottle Candelabra. You just empty some wine bottles, which yep. is my favorite part of the project. There you go. It really is. You have to drink it first, obviously. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Paint the bottles black. Okay. And then you can put a spooky sticker on it, or it, you know, you can download these apothecary labels from my website. It's a free download oh, at Voltaire.net. Awesome. And you put a white candle on it, let it start dripping. You get six or seven of these together, and it really is going to look like something so you'd find in Dracula's castle. Yeah. This is amazing. Thank wow, you. that's really cool. And I feel like this, I mean, if you're buying wine already, then you, you already got half of your, your items needed, right? Why waste the bottles? I Why agree. waste them? 